I'm going to stop before I eat dinner every single day and eat 12 leaves. <laughs> it's a lot of leaves. What's a teeny tiny food habit you're working on in 2022 and why? I'm Todd Coleman. I'm the creative content director at The Spruce Eats. I want to cook dishes that I've never tried before. Each month, I'm going to drop a penny on the map, and I'm going to cook a dish from that place that I've never made before. Hi, I'm Eric Handelsman. I'm the general manager of The Spruce Eats, and I'm here to tell you about my teeny tiny food habit for 2022. I feel like 2021 was the year I perfected regular old sourdough bread. So in 2022, I have promised to use my sourdough starter for other things. So what I've promised to myself is that each week I'm gonna find a recipe that is not bread to use my starter and just make it on the weekend. So cinnamon rolls, pancakes. I mean, who knows, the options are endless. Uh, I'm really excited to dig in and explore. Hi, I'm King Pajana Kong. I'm a chef at The Spruce Eats. My teeny tiny food habit for 2022 is to eat more and to eat less more of the good stuff and less of the bad stuff. For me, eating more of the good stuff means, I guess, eating more green salads and going on less fried chicken binges. That's for me, uh, but you know, everything's kind of good, right? Hi, my name is Tamara Melton. I'm a registered dietitian nutritionist and medical reviewer for Spruce Eats. So the 2022 habit, food habit, that I would like to work on is to overcome my fear of making croissants. So I don't think I have a fear of making croissants, but they're one of those foods that I have always been like, oh, I'm gonna make croissants and just really talking all big and bad about it. And I haven't done it. I've gone out on social media and like texted friends and be like, I'm making these croissants. And I think I just have like a mental block in knowing all the folding and the flipping and the rolling and the butter and all that good stuff. So they will be like the best croissants I've ever had if they come out well, because I will have made them. That's my goal for 2022 is to actually get in this kitchen, make some space in my counter and actually make some croissants. And yes, dietitians do eat croissants because we eat food just like you do and all foods can fit into your body and you can still be healthy. Hi, I'm Kristen Stengel and I'm an editor at The Spruce Eats. I'm in The Spruce Eats kitchen right now and my tiny food habit for 2022 is to do more DIY food projects. So I was big into pickling back in like 2015 or so and I kind of let it go. So this year coming up, I really wanna focus on things like fermenting or trying to make some DIY liqueurs like limoncello or Campari. So I'm gonna try once a month to tackle something that is a fun little food arts and crafts type project. Hello, my name is Victoria Height and I'm the editorial project manager for The Spruce Eats. This year, I'm hoping to work on being more mindful of the herbs, the fresh herbs that I buy and I consume. I have this tendency to buy a lot of fresh herbs, like a big bushel of cilantro or parsley or mint, and then I don't end up using all of it. And that really bothers me because I hate food waste. So what I'm trying to do this year is be more mindful of how much um, the different recipes that I'm using and making sure that I'm actually incorporating those fresh herbs into those recipes. And if for whatever reason I don't have enough recipes for the week that can use fresh herbs, I want to be better at making sure I can make the herbs last longer. So whether that's doing flavor bombs where you can pair spices and herbs together and freeze them in your ice cube tray or just freezing water with mint and then maybe do some berries or doing some like lime and cilantro frozen together in the ice tray as well. Hi, I'm Hetty Hunt. I'm a video producer at The Spruce Eats and my teeny tiny food habit of 2022 is to eat more fruit every day. I have thrown out my last bad strawberry. I am done with letting fruit go bad in my fridge. I'm Lauren Bodden. I'm a food editor at The Spruce Eats in The Spruce Eats test kitchen right now. My teeny tiny food habit for 2022 is to stop throwing away my greens. So each week I will try to either freeze them, juice them, eat salads, braise them, whatever, but I need to stop letting them go to rot in my drawer. I'm Heather. I'm the editorial director of The Spruce Eats. What is my tiny habit? I'm going to stop before I eat dinner every single day in January and eat 12 leaves. Could be parsley, could be kale, maybe it's gonna be cabbage. <laughs> it's a lot of leaves. And the reason is because I want to pause before I eat dinner to just pay attention to what I'm doing. Hello everyone, 
My name is Carlos Santa Cruz, and I am an assistant social media editor at The Spruce Eats. I personally believe 2022 is going to be our year. My teeny tiny food habit that I'm working on in 2022 is to try different leafy greens every single month because I find myself buying the same bag of spinach and kale, and they end up just going bad in my fridge anyway. So I want to try Swiss chard, maybe escarole. These are all different options. Why go basic when we can aim higher? Cheers to a greener year.